Hey guys, what's up? My name is Mr. Energy, and today we're playing a game called Subnautica. Now, as you can see, I have not played this game before, but I do know one thing about it is that the sound actually will not work unless I skip the intro, and I'm not sure why that is. Um, I tried loading it up, sound didn't work, I kept going back and forth, uh, trying to figure it out. Eventually, I figured out that you actually have to skip the intro. In order to get the sound, that is as far as I've been into the game, as you can see, it didn't even save, it was so short. So, we're going to go straight into survival, um, because that sounds like something I would do. And uh, here we go. And since I've loaded up once before, uh, I can actually get through this loading screen really, really quick. But if you do have this issue yourself, just skip the intro, and typically it will work just fine for you. So, uh, because I have to skip the intro, I'm just going to go straight in and uh, start right where we crash land, I guess. So, yay. <laughs> yeah, alright. So, I'll see you in a little bit. Alright, so here we are. Um, the place is just blowing up. Because there is sound, which is good. And I have a fire extinguisher here. Uh, left mouse button, okay. And uh, we got some damaged stuff here. Ooh, medical stuff. Ooh, medical stuff. Okay. So, uh, fabricator. I don't really know how to use anything yet. Uh, resources. Um, okay, so we have a health and water bar. And here we are. On a stranded planet. Uh, I have no idea where we are. All I know is this is water. For sure. And that is the plant, that is the uh, device that we crashed, device, that's the big ship that we crashed on, I think it was called the Aurora. And this is our little bobber thing. I'll probably call it the bobber, bob, bobber, 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 bobber sounds good. It's got to name everything, right? This, this is a game about naming things. Anyways, so that is that, and then, um... What we have here is a couple of blueprints, uh, ladders, titanium, titanium, okay. Um, so it looks like we're gonna need titanium to start. Don't have any logs, any of this stuff. I probably won't pay much attention to that anyway. What I'm gonna try to do is I'm gonna try to make a helmet, uh, a suit, maybe an air tank eventually. Um, and just try to survive for this first episode. And then next episode, I want to look for land, because I hope there's land in this one. I'd actually, there might not be land anywhere, but if there is land, I hope to find it. What are you? Did you just fart? Okay, we shall call you the Toxic Farts. My goodness. Oh, I got a name for one thing. Um, got some underwater plants. Uh, what's this? Is this, is this a piece of rubble? Is that, is that a, is that a shark? Okay, it's grabbing that, so. I can dig in there. That's a fragment. Break limestone, okay. That's good to know. Looks like I, ha I do have an error gauge, so I gotta watch that. Where's Bobber at? Where's my Bobber? Okay. We're apparently the uh, number five. Alright. So, let's see if I can catch one of these. Come on. New creature discovered. W what is that? Like a boomerang? Bo <laughs> boomerang! Exactly what it's called. Okay, boomerang fish! Alright, um, I don't really think that putting uh, a fire out in the ocean is really that important right now, but what are you? Attention, detecting increased local radiation levels. Trent is consistent with ongoing degradation of the Aurora's dark matter drive core due to damage sustained during collision. Continuing to monitor. Okay, so we also have an automated voice apparently, so what should we name her? Maria. We'll call her Maria. Oh my goodness, those things scare me to death every time they scream at me. 
keep thinking of big monsters in the water you're gonna see here. Also, I've noticed there's a couple of rendering things going on here where it looks kind of weird. Um, I can promise you that's not my computer, uh, not being able to handle things because it's a pretty good computer. What's this? Ah! Dairy fish? Ooh, what's that? What are you? I like these. These are cool. New creature discovered. Highly recommended before contact. Um, I'll grab a whole bunch of these. They look good. Emergency. Oh, ten, seconds ten seconds. Oxygen remaining. Thank you, Maria. They probably get really annoying after a little while. <laughs> oh my guy's choking. Okay, that's a thing. Okay, boomerang. Boomerang fish. Come here, boomerang. I want my food. I wonder how many of these I can catch. What? It's like an optical illusion. They always look like they're really far away, but they're like right next to me. Ooh, there's another one of those things. Okay. So we need to work on food. There's the bobber. We need to work on food. And we need to work on uh, eating uh, eating food and water. That's what we're after. I don't know why I was thinking of that. Boomerang fish. Um, one of these fish have got to be good for water, I'm sure. Uh, which one is it, though? Okay, so resources, electro. Uh, oh, here is food. Here's water. So water comes from air sac, which was... Mm, oh, those are the ones I like. Okay, so those are the air sacs. I'll make a whole bunch of water out of that because I'm sure we'll run out of water. That seems to be a thing every, every game I play, you know. Live in the ocean and can't get water, so that is one thing I want to make sure that I have plenty of. Alright, and then cooked food, I can uh, cook the Gary's fish and I can cook the boomerang. That's good to know. Alright, and I'm not sure if things spoil this game, but just in case they do, um, I probably should eat all those or enough that I can live off of. For a while, at least. Okay, there's that. Um, eat that. Oh wow, that brings up that brings up food a lot, and these not so much. Um, twelve and that. Okay, this brings up twenty. Oh shoot, that's that's really good. Okay, so we have copper ore, lead, and here's some metal savage. Salvage, savage. I don't know where my words are coming from. Oh, they. Okay, so those make titanium. That's good to know because titanium. <laughs> I mean, why not? All right, so that is so things take different sizes. It looks like. Um. So what I probably should make is a. Yeah, oh, okay. So the whole suit comes in this. So I need fiber mesh and lead. Fiber mesh and silver ore. Silicone rubber. I don't know where I'm gonna get that. Okay, there's titanium and glass. Where am I gonna get glass from? Uh, oh, is that glass? Stalker tooth. Oh no, that's that's got, got that's got glass in it. Okay, quartz. I need two quartz. Wrong button. Here we go. Um. Actually, I wonder if there's any form of weapon I can get first. So, as far as weapons are concerned, can I build... Oh, there's a knife. Titanium and silicone rubber. And silicone rubber is made out of creeper vine seed clusters. So, we'll go this way. I don't really know... She said there's radiation... Oh! There's stuff right here. Good for me. She said there's radiation in the opposite direction, so I don't really want to get that... What is that? This is some sort of... Oh, okay, that's quartz. Oh! There's a way to get wa uh, air down here. That's great. Could always use that. Sorry. Get out of my way, fish. Caution. Continued degradation of the Aurora's drive core may cause a quantum detonation. Calculating risk assessment. Death by malnourishment. 7%. By physical injury. 11% by exposure 
to radioactive crash site materials, 19%. If the drive core is breached, probability of death increases to 65%. Oh, jeez! Emergency, 10 seconds. I know, I know, I know, I'm getting here right now. Thank you. <laughs> Those brain looking things down there. I don't even know what they're called, but. Toxic farts might be an issue for me. If I can't eat them, they're just gonna be annoying because I don't really want to get in the way of. Shoot, is it nighttime already? Jeez. Okay, so. Back in this machine, here we go. And, uh, water. I don't really need water right now. I don't really want to cook the air sacs. Um, as far as equipment, uh, how do I make a knife? Silicone rubber, which is made out of what? Lubricant. <laughs> we don't need that. Not yet, at least. <laughs> okay, what did that make? Two? That made two, right? Oh, no, that makes one. Using two cluster seeds. And how many? I have one left. I probably should make the rest of this titanium. I probably ought to have to find some sort of... Uh, what do they call the chest or something to put things in because I'm gonna run a room really fast if I don't. Oh, there we go. Survival knife. Uh, I probably should put that in my inventory. Oh, it already is number three. Um, okay, about two and a half million years ago. I don't really care right now, but thanks, anyways. Uh, creeper vine cluster seed. I don't really know what I need this for. Can I drop it? I don't know if I can drop it or not. Anyways, uh, drop that. Uh, climb ladder. Inventory secured. Okay, so we have a knife. What else do I need to... Start me out. I needed fiber mesh. Oh, I just need more silicone rubber. Okay, so I should probably wrong button. Uh, go this way. All right. So I'm gonna actually have to end the episode here uh, because we we're figuring out what we gotta do real quick. I need to find rubber, not rubber, uh, land at some point. If I can't, if I can't find. That's a huge moon. Holy cow. It's moving so quick. I'm impressed that there isn't like tidal waves everywhere. Realistically, there would be. It's a bird. Well, if there's birds, there's got to be land somewhere, right? All right, so I'm going to look for that in the next episode after I get some uh, goody stuff. But that's a huge moon. Anyways, I will see you in the next video. Make sure to leave a double thumbs up down below. It really helps a lot. And it helps me know that you guys like this type of stuff. Throw a comment down below if you like this series. And um, we will uh, see you in the next video. Bye-bye.